We are here in our championship match. Caleb James in the first frame. Puts 10 back. I still don't think he's going to strike on the right lane, though. There. Yeah. <laughs> this is Patrick Gigstad's quest for his first banner, his first title. He won his first match ever in Stepladder today. Yeah, Pat Pat's winning his banner. It's decided. The gods have spoken. When he wins his first title, he's gonna go completely ape shit and go on a cussing spree. Every game, five, seven, he said he's gonna throw. Who do you think you are? I am in there. He's gonna crotch chop. He's gonna say fuck all oh, y'all, suck my dick. And he told Dot as soon as I win my banner, I'm doing it. She said, well. Won't nobody be there, so all right then. Uh, he ain't gonna forget about it. Hey, I double fist. I'm double fist, a baby. The girls match. Madison Janik, Janak. She's killing them. See what she does for the front three, if she can handle it. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Ten back. She's winning this motherfucker. She's 13. Caleb James. Oh, he moved right. Oh. Uh, that's the issue on that lane. Kick the shit out of him, Katie. <laughs> Never answers. Where are we going for lunch? Oh yeah, I forgot you said that. <clears throat> Dallas, you coming to Masters? Coming to Masters? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. If you win a tournament, you get free entry into Masters. <clears throat> No, it's been since TSR is made. Madison all up in front of the camera. Do what? They let people come in that have mold, like, you know, you put the mold, what? The four? The four? Yeah. I ain't never heard them last doing year, that. The last year I bowled, there was like six years of four or five people that came in that mold one on that scene. They bowled at least three. You can pay for one. No. Madison Janik is whipping this ass. She's put 10 back with authority. Yeah, he's over there. He's back there by the register. Well, hell yeah. High game trophy, baby. <laughs> Who shot 300 there? Probably Terry. Cooper. Terry. Cooper Terry. and Terry. Yeah. Yeah, because that dude walked out of the way. Trips the four. Oh, she, she messed up. Dude, her, her, you want to talk about Pat's mental game? Her mental game is horrible. Dude, she was in first yesterday. I was bowling with her the second four. And uh, uh, she shot 170. Oh, yeah, I remember seeing that. Yeah, she started crying because she shot 170 and she was in first. She thought she was going to drop out of cut.
Uh-oh. Mackenzie made a ball change. We might have a match here, boys. We got 279 to 290 at the moment. <coughs> While we're deadlocked at 280 in our guys' match. Oh, baby, get through the pins. Yep. He didn't get that one in there. that good. Oh. Oh, come on, Pat. God damn. <laughs> yeah. She said, take your 279 and shove it. <laughs> See what Caleb James has to respond here. I say 2810s. Oh, uh, yeah. <clears throat> Telling you. It's that wet, dry spot on the right lane. Hooper kept hitting it. What percentage is that? 68? Did do 21 divided by 30 in your calculator. Say, so I was pretty close there. Uh, whenever I was bowling tough shots in Charleston, Madison Janag on a sport pattern went front nut. She is Janak. It, it, no, you really say it Janik, but I say Janak. It makes it sound better. Anyway, in Tough Shots, I was bowling with her on the fucking sport pattern. She went front nine, wrapped in. Shot 279. And she won with them? No, she just started bowling competitively last year. She had only been bowling all stars before that. See, I, honestly, I blame my grandma for the reason I, I was not as good as I am now earlier in my years. I, oh, oh. <clears throat> yeah, as I kid you not, I had asked to go to TSRs whenever I was 12, 13, average of 190, you know. Figured I'd have a chance. Well, my grandma tells me, hell no, you are not going to go waste my money at TSR. If you can't average 200 at league. So until I averaged 200 whenever I was 14, I was not allowed to go to TSR. So I did not show up on the competitive bowling circuit until I was 14. It's like as good as Cannon is, as good as Brianna is. I honestly feel like that could have been me if I just would have got a couple. Uh, I mean, still, just their raw talent level. <clears throat> it's 5 7 10. Madison Janak is your champion. Unless she opens and gets zero in these next two frames. Oh, baby, get through the pins. Oh, my ha. God. <laughs> <laughs> three, three against him. Yeah. <laughs> She said, fuck NC8 A&T. Watch it pop it out. No, no, he's going the wrong way. <clears throat> I wonder if she starts crying because she won. 
Yeah. Tell you what. I I don't know what it is, but bitches just love to cry for no reason. I mean, I don't care if I won the fucking Monte Carlo Grand Prix. Had ten million in my bank just because I won that. I would not start crying. Depends how emotional you are. Yeah, I As you can tell, I ain't very emotional. (laughs) No. Yeah. Uh, he's got a little bit of a off rack. Uh, the six pins off to the right. Yeah. See, the issue is you just get too fucking hype. You throw the ball too hard and don't go through the pins. So stay slow and the ball will roll. That's all you have to do, Pat. We, we can sit here and watch you. Whenever you stay calm and slow, the ball gets through the pins fine. You don't. You don't need to hook the ball. You can hook the ball by slowing it down. If you slow down, you can do that. Yes, it is. You don't have to move your. Yeah. Oh, 258. Doesn't that mean Gary wins? Yep. Where's he at? Back there. Madison Janak is your girl's champion. God damn it, it's fucking Janak. <laughs> where, where are you supposed to be in six minutes? Home? Uh, you can be a little bit late. What time is tea time? Oh, yeah, you got to All right, so that's 50 minutes. Yeah. You got, and your tea time ain't till 150. We need at least 10 minutes to get the right. Okay, so you're at 1250. Ball. Ball. Almost 810. <clears throat> now he fist pumped now. Can I get a shout out to Mr. Burt Huntley who owes me 10 bucks? Yeah. Thank you very much. Hey, by score, almost 258 if she strikes. Two fifty eight, two twenty eight. Pat, step off the approach. Step goddamn. And Seven pins on this lane already. Yeah. I mean, hell, even. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Even though he opened, fucking Caleb threw it in the ditch. There you go. Seven ten. Hell yeah.
don't know what's around. Here. Get fit. Around here, Pat, where we he said he's not deciding. Huh? Tell your daughter to decide. Everything's like four miles away. Yeah. yeah. Seven nines again. Uh, uh, that, 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 yeah, that ball return might get broke. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> See, he got that one in there and it went down the lane. Fire crotch. See, so got it in the air. Look what happened. Right through the pants. <laughs> I don't know, I guess. Uh, I mean, he threw it good, but like I was saying, it's just all about your bowling IQ. I mean, if you see when you let it down, it don't go through the pins. But when you get it in the air, it goes through the pins. I mean, you want to get it in the air. Hey, tile shot. Two hands. Granny. Do the granny. Ha! One time. One time. Ah. Uh, See, if we were in Charleston, that would be on Sportsman like, and you'd get a warning. <laughs> Dude, I was bowling Jake Didonato, and uh, they, they, they put me on the pair that I had just shot 160 on the game before step ladder. So, obvious, I'm not going to do well. I threw everything in my bag, still didn't have a look, and Jake went front eight. So the ninth and tenth frame, I was fucking done. So I put my regular shoes back on and bowled in house shoes the rest of the game. Well, after I finished the ninth frame, the guy that runs the travel league down there comes up to me and says, listen here, I don't appreciate you doing that. That's, that's not right. Parents are complaining. I say, all right, whatever. The next tournament, the one that we just bowled not too long ago, they have a meet. Well, I get a letter in the mail from him saying that they don't appreciate that. The association doesn't think it's good for me to do that. I'm not setting a good example for the younger bowlers. But then at the tournament we just had, they had a meeting before Travel League strictly to address my own sportsmanlike conduct and say, well, we, don't, we have a no tolerance rule here. Caleb James wins TSR in his first TSR ever. Yeah, I can do it like that. 